I'm joined by Cam Rayner and our CEO Greg Swan. Cam, you're back at training from this afternoon and you're kicking off with some pretty exciting news. Yeah, so I've extended my contract for another two years. So I'll be up in, um, in Brisbane for four years now, which is uh, very exciting. So the team's looking like it's going in the right direction. I want to be a part of that, so yeah. When did this conversation first start happening? Uh, well, it was probably uh, a little bit before the Tassie camp and then on the Tassie camp, that's probably when we, we started to go with it. So been holding my tongue for the last couple of months. So. <laughs> but no, yeah, it's good that it's finally come out and um, yeah, happy to be here. You haven't played a game with us yet, but what's it, why do you love this club so much already? Yeah, I think it's just because there is so, many, so much young talent here. You know what I mean? It's really easy to mingle with everyone because everyone's kind of going through the same thing. And obviously it's really pretty nice living up in Brisbane, you walk around in t-shirts shorts every day. So, But yeah, I think it's just as a whole, the club's been really, really good to me. And I think that, yeah, it's someone I want to be, like spend the rest of my or footy with uh, just for now. Fantastic news. Now you've been living with our CEO, Greg Swan. Greg, have you had a big part to play in this? No, I think Leone's cooking's been the uh, <laughs> secret. No, look, we, um, no, Dom Ambrosio, the, our list manager, sort of started conversations with um, Cam's management reasonably soon after the uh, draft so now they've done all that and they did a terrific job and yeah I think it was we got a call just before Christmas to say everything had been agreed so no you're right it's a great time for the club and uh, we're wrapped to have him for um, at least for four years. What's he like as a housemate? No no he's very good he um, him and Toby Wool are here and they're both uh, pretty neat and tidy and you know they pull their weight so uh, yeah we were we did the dishes last night after uh, after dinner so no they're all good they're both good the boys and it's been uh, it's been easy having him here and as from your role as ceo we're really starting to build a reputation as becoming a destination club would you agree oh look i think this year helped i mean especially with luke hodge coming on board and then charlie cameron in the trade period we think we did really well in the draft um yeah and you know we've already had some really good signings you know hugh mcgluggage before christmas uh, jared berry before that as well so all the young guys are buying in, um, you know, the experience that Hodges brought in, you know, Beamsy, you know, back on the track and, you know, going really well as the skipper. You know, there, there is, there's a fantastic vibe around the place. Um, can't wait for the season to start, actually. Like, the boys are back today, but, and look, it'll be on us quickly, but we can't wait. We're, we're really excited about it, and I think we'll be, uh, we'll surprise a few this year. And Cam, you were saying down in Melbourne you were itching to get back to Queensland. Yeah, 100%. Um, obviously it was good to see the family have a break, but I think, yeah, I just wanted to come back and get stuck in a training and, you know, hopefully the next couple of, a couple of weeks we can improve, keep getting better and then, yeah, looking forward to how the season goes. And is your big goal to be named in that first 22? Oh, yeah, that'd be a good thing, but um, I think it's just improvement, you know, over the next couple of weeks consistently improving and then obviously going into the season if we can just keep obviously improving as an individual myself and as a team, I think that'd be awesome.